everyone welcome back to the channel uh, before we get started with this uh, review or showcase of the product here uh, I do want to mention that I didn't get a chance to do uh, two videos the previous week I'm actually falling behind I actually have uh, two videos in the queue that I need to finish editing um, I'm gonna get some some more footage for that today so I'll have behind as like I said I'm a little behind on here I've been doing some other personal stuff too uh, behind the camera so I didn't have a chance to really focus on the detailing stuff it's all good stuff on, on, on the background uh, I just kind of fell behind here so I'm gonna try to catch up here to get uh, two videos at a, at a time here plus I didn't really buy anything new until recently for the 4th of July so we'll be testing out some new products here I got the other couple ones here um, first one we're gonna look at today um, is Apex Auto Wash uh, this is 2.0 from Phoenix EOD um, I did buy this from Adrian's sites imdetailedaf.com um, so retails for this smaller bottle the 16 ounce bottle retails for $12.99 and I bought it through him because uh, okay, number one he's a follower of the channel he follows me on IG he follows Eddie and pretty much everybody else on here Jamie uh, so I was like you know what let me just support the dude and rather than him sending me free stuff because he was telling hey he's like, I want to send you some stuff I ended up uh, as I mentioned in a previous video I pulled a fast one on him and then I went ahead and just purchased some stuff and he said I was cheating but he threw in a couple extra goodies so I appreciate Adrian for throwing those in there uh, so definitely check him out he's got a, a nice little website here he's got uh, I forget what brands he has in here um, Phoenix EOD and Auto Fiber for sure. So he's a um, plus he's actually only two hours away from me, so he shipped pretty darn fast uh, together. So we're gonna take a look at Apex Auto Wash, and uh, let's see what it says on here. It says uh, we all know it was designed from by Apex or around Apex um, Brian over at Apex. Uh, so let's just take a look at this and it says uh, it's pH neutral. And it said it's formulated around Brian Specs. Apex Auto Wash contains no dyes, fragrances for optical additives or optical additives. And it says provides thick, highly lubricious suds that gently and effectively lift dirt and grime from your vehicle's surface. pH balanced. Um, okay, it's safe to use on paint without worrying of dulling or stripping previously applied wax or protection. Safe to use on vinyl wraps and even matte finishes. And the dilutions in here, so if you want to do it by hand it's 0.3 ounces in a five gallon bucket and then you use pressurized water to of course agitate and foam it up if you want to use it in a, it says machine use pressure washer dilute half an ounce to one ounce per gallon of water okay um, so I think that's pretty much it here nothing else to this so I want to just we're gonna put some in the bucket and I'm going to put some in a foam can. I'm not going to do a pre-foam because the car's not dirty enough. I'm just going to go ahead and pre-rinse it off. And then I'm going to go ahead and, and foam it with this. And then we're going to get to the contact wash. So again, I don't have to do a pre-foam because the car is not very dirty. That's one of the benefits of living in Southern California. Uh, the weather right now is perfect in the summer. Right now it's like 75 degrees outside. It's not super hot. So let me just go ahead and take the little red plug out of here first. These are always kind of painful to get out of here. We got that one in one shot. So we're going to shake this up. I'm going to add one ounce in here, which is 30 milliliters. And I, and I brought the measuring cup just to show you what it has in here. I have 700 milliliters of water in the Griot's foam cannon. Uh, I know people get weird when people say Griot's. It's actually Griot's with a silent T. Um, so let's just go ahead and kind of, you can see the consistency is pretty thin. Uh, think of it like CarPro uh, Reset. So that's around 30. And I'm probably going to add about the same amount maybe 40 milliliters in the bucket we'll see uh, but this is all you really need again it's it's a nice thin cons consistency meaning it's not going to stick in your cup if you're diluting it kind of like a uh, like incredible suds or adam's car shampoo where it's a little bit on the thick side then you're going to have to kind of take that out so i'm just going to set this up i'm going to go ahead and wash the wheels first and then i'll come back to you when i'm ready to foam foam the car up but uh, I, I got them mixed up in the uh, Griot's foam cannon and again I will just take the same amount and put it in the bucket uh, maybe I'll put like I said maybe I'll put 40 milliliters we'll probably gonna play around with the dilutions in the bucket uh, because I'm gonna produce nice lather with this on the surface so um, let me just wash the wheels and then I'll come back to you during the foaming process so be right back welcome back here so I'm about to foam this up with uh, Apex Auto Wash but uh, check out Hydro Light again Okay. 
definitely super hydrophobic. I haven't topped it since the first wash three weeks ago or something like that with two weeks ago, maybe three weeks, somewhere around there uh, with C6 mist. So I don't think mist is around anymore, but it, it could be wrong. I don't think it's meant to be super durable. Let me put this, I need to get one of those mad car care things for my, uh, my thing here. Let me just put this down for here for now. Okay, so let's take a look at Apex Auto Foam. Shake it up in here. So I probably could have added another ounce in there. There we go. It's not super thick. It's a little watery, that's okay. And you can see the coating that's fighting that this soap. Got it. Don't have a lot of room on this side here. It does have hydro glass on there. Okay, so let me just foam this because I don't have a lot of room on the sides here. I moved it back here because I wanted shade. You can lay it on thick. I mean, it's not bad. I still have a few ounces left over. So it's not super thick, but that's all right. Again, it doesn't have to be super thick foam. We're just laying that on there to check out the lubrication on there. Put that in there. And I'm only going to use, actually I need to agitate this. I'm all out of sync. When I'm, I'm all out of sync right uh, today, I don't know why. Since the beginning, since I woke up this morning. That's I'm only using two mitts and the car wasn't overly dirty. Again, I'm just doing this just to show you guys how Apex Auto Wash does. You can see that coating just fight this off. Actually, I should have started from the top. already pre-rinsed this so I'm not too worried about dragging dirt I mean that coating so one of the benefits of this coating here this hydro light coating it's super hydrophobic and the self-clean of it it's just it's top-notch and so the question is is it as good as ADS quartz the three-year coating because C6 Hydro Light is still, I would say, it's kind of hard to, it's a, because it's available to the consumer, it's still a consumer based coating. Um, but it's a professional grade coating, just like ADS Quartz. You know, ADS Quartz is it a professional grade coating that's available to the consumer. So we're just going to answer the question is, you know, Hydro Light as durable as ADS Quartz, because ADS Quartz is fantastic. Actually, 
I don't think, I don't know if I've mentioned it, but that's actually my top coating of choice at the moment. Just watch this. And if Hydro Light does pretty darn good, it'll end up in that same category. Okay, so let's talk about the soap. Excellent lubrication thus far. Well, the other reason it wasn't sticking is because I pre-rinsed it with um, with water. So the coating has had time to kind of just fight it off. We'll come back and get the bottoms after. And I put the uh, hydro glass on this um, back piece of glass. So I get to finish my video to show you the hydrophobics from it. Yeah, so far this soap is pretty good. I like—I mean, I like it. I like the way it feels underneath the the mitt. here and I'm gonna get the bottoms with this other one here on the plastic trim and because it's summer and the trim is relatively clean I picked up some dirt and the majority of this actually is trim See, that one wasn't dirty. Actually, I cleaned out on that. Okay. A little bit of dirt, too, on there. Okay. Let's take a look at how easy it rinses off. And if it does impact the coating, which it's it's not, I can tell you that already. I mean, check that out. That's really good. So.
That's pretty good. Okay, so that's pretty much it as far as Apex Auto Wash. You can see Did not impact the coating, it rinsed off clean. Uh, it felt really good underneath the wash mitt. So it felt really good again um, with the wash. So good lubricity, good, I mean, it cleaned well. I mean, it, the car wasn't overly dirty, but again, it's summer and, um, you know, we're not finding rain or anything like that so clean really well didn't impact the coating rinsed off clean good lubrication of the mitt so overall i think it's a good soap and i think it i mean it foams pretty good like you could probably you can adjust it definitely how much uh, foam you want to produce if you want a thicker foam just add a little bit more foam on there uh, how it does it do as a as a pre-foam i didn't really try it because this car didn't really need it uh, at the time uh, because it wasn't overly dirty but uh, overall I think it does a good job. I think it does a good job at everything. It just checks the boxes. Again, we'll try it again when the car is a little more dirty. I haven't washed it in about a week and a half, I think is roughly where I was at. Uh, maybe I'll wash my dad's car with it and just kind of see how it does uh, because I haven't washed his in like two weeks or uh, going on two weeks. So we'll see and we'll check it out. So again, thanks for watching. If you have any comments or questions, go ahead and post down below. If you use Apex Auto Wash, go ahead and post down below. I'm really curious to hear what you guys think about it. And again, thanks for watching. I'll catch you next one. So take care, everyone.